The president is uh, previewing the debut of uh, the Ken Burns uh, series on National Parks, uh, America's Best Idea. Uh, it is uh, a program which uh, Ken Burns and Dayton Duncan have worked on for over 12 years, and it really does uh, tell the history of the national parks and their creation, and the fact that uh, it took great courage and leadership on the part of many for the creation of these crown jewels. And had we not taken those actions, in many cases 100 years ago, uh, these places would now be there for our children and our grandchildren and generations to come. Instead of having uh, Yellowstone or Yosemite National Parks, you might have gated communities in there with uh, very uh, expensive places uh, for people to live. I think in uh, President Obama's own childhood experience as an 11-year-old, it was like coming back full circle. You know, I stood with him uh, at Yellowstone and uh, we talked uh, as we went around uh, some of the geysers. and. It was uh, incredible to me as I was uh, talking to him and watching his children play uh, to see a person who is now president of the United States of America who walked in those same places, on those same trails, in those same geysers as an 11-year-old boy and now president of the United States. Very remarkable. It really tells an American story. You know, the thing I remember most was, you know, driving by and, and seeing it was elk. And then I remember seeing black bears. And, uh, and I remember bison. And I, in fact, I yeah. ran up close to a bison <laughs> to get good pictures. We have uh, huge challenges out there in terms of the restoration of our rivers and creating urban parks and telling America's uh, story through, uh, histo through uh, historic preservation uh, in uh, preserving uh, landscapes and national significance like the Great Lakes, the Chesapeake, Everglades, the Appalachian Range, uh, the Crown of the Continent, and a whole host of other places. And so, I hope that this is a time when out of this crisis we will see emerging uh, a conservation agenda that will define the 21st century for America.